As inflation continues to trend mostly lower around the world, many market participants are attempting to discern when the Fed and other central banks might begin to cut rates. As this continues to unfold, it is not only the timing, but equally if not more important are the expectations that are priced into the markets. One of the biggest questions driving these expectations? Does inflation need to fall to 2% or below for policymakers to initiate the cuts? I would say no. However, as has been pointed out, policymakers need to feel confident that the declining inflation trend will continue to move lower for an extended period. Recent data has indicated that six-month trends are at or below the 2% target, but Fed officials along with other central bankers don't believe this is a big enough sample to begin to cut rates, particularly with the January U.S. inflation data demonstrating a backup as both CPI and PPI came in hotter than expected. Another factor shifting expectations is the strong labor market and economic data in a solid growth pattern. Should the consumer begin to lose confidence and the labor market begin to weaken, I don't believe the Fed and other central banks will wait too long to begin to cut rates even if the year-over-year -year inflation remains above 2%.